Hey, welcome to Wisdom Wednesday. I've got a quick tip for you. I'm going to squeeze in a little gratitude Wisdom Wednesday before November is over. Some of you may have been Join me on the November challenge, and I hope that worked well for you. I will be doing it again next year, so don't you worry. But now, in this last Wednesday of November, we're going to talk about gratitude, but in a little bit different way. What I want you to do is notice what my client noticed. Uh, she was very upset with her teenager. They're in a big power struggle. Err, and I said, okay, stop. Can you just tell me five things that you love about your kid? I mean, crickets. About 30 seconds passed and she said, oh my gosh, this is terrible. I, I, I can't think of any. And then she came up with three right away. I added one based on just listening to her. And then she added a fifth one. So she did come up with five, but she was stumped at first. Not because she doesn't know how great her kid is, not because she's not a loving mom, but because she has been focusing so much on all the negatives that she couldn't see the positives anymore. So if you think you're in this negative, just make a quick list of the things that you're grateful for about your kid, the things you love about your kid, and just write them down. And then look at them at night before you go to bed. Feel grateful for it. In the morning, take a quick glance at it. Anytime you need to, look at that list. Because as crazy as our kids make us, we have to keep in the forefront of our minds all the positives. And you're not gonna excuse misbehavior, but it's gonna to help to keep you calm. Because my client was focusing on all the negatives and then she was doing this, oh my gosh, if I don't get this taken care of, she's gonna be this, fill in all the negative words. But if we focus on the positive, it makes us more calm and we're able to handle misbehavior when it comes or delay giving a consequence until we're calm and we've really thought about it in a reasonable way. Okay, there's your Wisdom Wednesday tip. Have a wonderful week.